Hey guys, Christina Steinbrook here and Kip Steinbrook, superstar directors for the Fresh Sense of Smell Air Sensi Fragrance. So, we got our Warm of the Month box in today. Look at that. It says Sensi on it. It's upside down. So I opened it upside down because I'm a clever girl. Um, so, we got this in today. I actually cheated and uh, we didn't get this in today. We got it a few days ago. Um, I cheated. And I put some in Eliza's room already. If you want to see her, she's she's losing right here. <laughs> but um, I put some in her room already, and uh, it's like when did I get this? I don't know. Like four days ago, five days ago. Um, and I actually put some in her room already, and it still smells amazing already in there. I figured like I'd put it in there because her it was a brand new warmer. It never had scent in there before, um, in her room at all. So I was like, it's like a clean slate for it. It's delicious. So um, I don't know if Kip has smelled it bar form yet. So we're gonna smell it, and I'm gonna show you what comes in the warmer of the month box. Um, if you look at the caption, um, any of my customers, if you guys want a sample of Country Plum, um, please fill that form out. <clears throat> I was sending samples out um, to my latest 50 customers, but I wasn't really receiving any response. So um, I think I'm going to go back to how I used to, where I just post the form every month. And customers, you guys, if you want a sample, fill that out. I'll send it. Um, instead of doing it kind of like systematically, I think I'm just going to do it to whoever wants it now instead. Um, we'll try that for a little bit, see which one gets the best response, um, and see where we end up with that. So sometimes it's okay to go back to... Uh, old school methods to try it out or reignite something. So, um, cause I was sending out like 150 samples for a while and receiving no response. Um, so I wasn't maybe sending them quite to the right people. And then I started sending them to the last 50 who'd order, no response. Um, so I really just want to make sure I'm sending them exactly to who wants them. Um, that way you guys get them if you want them. That's pretty novel, right? So anyway, fill out that form if you're one of my customers. Um, and want a sample of Country Plum. Um, so I got my Warmer of the Month kit in. If any of you guys have been watching my crazy posts lately about the Warmer of the Month, you'll know which one I'm about to show you in the flesh. Um, I have not opened the box at all yet, just the Scentsy box, and I stole one bar out. So, um, And your Warmer of the Month kit, like I always tell you, comes with stickers, these flyers. I love whatever the design team has been doing with Scentsy lately. Because, like, those are really pretty. You want to open those? Mm -hmm. Go for it. Kip Steinbrook's going to open them. Um, and it comes with a room spray. So that will probably go into one of my basket parties. It comes with this bagged air. It comes with ten bars. I'm going to leave one over there. One for Kip, one for me. And then it comes with ten of those bars, like I said. And then it comes with your warmer of the month. I get this every single month, uh, the warmer of the month kit. I don't even care if I don't like the warmer because you know what? Here's the thing. Somebody will like the warmer. Um, so you can always offload it to a customer or use it in a raffle somewhere. Um, obviously, this one is not one that we're going to have any trouble with somebody loving. Um, but I always get the warmer of the month kit. If you're a consultant, I would just say make it good practice to do it every month. I have a VIP subscription to Laundry Monthly, and then I have a warmer of the month kit monthly, which is 150 every single month in PRV. I'm just saying it's really easy to get 150 in PRV. So uh, especially if you're using your products. So I do warmer of the month because it helps me send samples to customers, helps me try new stuff, gives me some fun stuff to mess with, and then I do my VIP. So easy peasy. Kip's looking at the flyer here. I'm gonna show you the warmer and then I'll show you the flyer so you can see what you can do with it. This is called the Reimagine Warmer from Scentsy. Um, all you need is some Sharpies and you're gonna be able to color your warmer. It's amazing. I have not done this yet. I'm sure everyone cannot believe that I have not colored my warmer yet. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna let Kip's favorite color it or me color it. I don't know who's gonna color it. Um, Either way, oh, this warmer is way bigger than I thought it was going to be. Like, I've seen a million pictures, but it's huge. Look how big this warmer is. There's lots of awesome real estate to cover. I think it's like one Eliza head large. Let's look. <laughs> oh, it's bigger than Eliza's head. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Scentsy, where warmers are bigger than my baby's head. Bigger than her head. <laughs> and currently, it's as bald as her head. We have not colored it yet. So... Um, it's gorgeous. If you guys can see all the 
I did not break the dish. <laughs> that would have been great. Um, all those little awesomeness that you can color. Let's see if I can get like no glare. No glare. Um, and you color it with Sharpies, just like an adult coloring book. The coolest thing about this is um, you can color it a million times. Like an adult coloring book, you can color once. Wine and Canvas, you paint that once. For $31.50, you actually get a warmer you can color a million times. You just let it, if you want those design to stay that you've colored, um, let it sit, don't touch it, because it's gonna take a little while to dry, and it'll be fine. Um, but if you wanna change it up, or if you wanna let your kids color it once or twice, but then you wanna color it, um, just use rubbing alcohol on a cotton ball, and you can rub all of the ink off and redo it again. Um, even if you've had it on there for a while, like if it's been warming and stuff, you can still do it again. So, isn't that cool? Yeah. I was thinking about like coloring it like, I don't know, I was thinking about like just coloring the background and leaving all of the designs white. I don't know. There's all kinds of cool stuff you can do. So, all right, I'm gonna smell the fragrance here. I'm gonna let you smell it. What markers do you use on this? Sharpies. Sharpies, and it comes off? If you use alcohol, uh-huh. Mm -hmm. It'll come right off. Very cool. I know. So I'm having um, warmer coloring parties because uh, like everyone will go what, wine and canvas for $35 for wine and then they'll paint something on the canvas and they may not even like the picture. Um, for this less than that, $31.50 this month, you can have a warmer coloring party and then you actually have a Scentsy warmer you get to take home and use. Like who hangs their canvases from wine and canvas? Anybody? You don't. I don't. I know our canvases. Where? Our Star Wars ones are good. Oh, we did make some cool Star Wars ones. We did hang those. But you know all those ones that you keep, like, he finds my canvases in storage and he's like, what do you want me to do with these? <laughs> and I put them back in storage. He's like, are you going to hang them anywhere? I'm like, no, they're ugly. Like, I did a good job painting them, but they're just not my style. Um, it's fun to paint, but you're not really going to take them home and hang them. This warmer, you're going to take it home and use it, even if it's adorable. Even if it's blank, it's a great warmer. Um, so this is Country Plum. Do you want to smell Country Plum? Let me know how you feel about it. Country Plum. Mm. Mmm, hashtag. Mmm. I like it. I do too. It's really earthy. Like, it's not as, like, fruity as you think you'd, like, Aussie Plum, um, which we have in the catalog already, is, like, really fruity. This one is a lot more earthy and florally, like, but not, like, the gross grandma floral. This is really, really good. It is really good. It's got, like, a tomato viney. Tomato vine plum smell. Plum. And we like our earthy smells, so this is a good stain brick smell. But it's kind of an earthy fruit smell. It's a good mix of both worlds. Mm -hmm. It's very spring. Um, what was the other one, that raspberry one? Black raspberry or something like that we have in Liza's room. Black raspberry vanilla? Is that what that's called? No, this is what I have in Liza's room right What's now. What's that one, the new, one of the new scents that we smelled that it's like a... Uh, there's one that's called raspberry, right? Raspberry bush or... Yeah, something like that. I don't remember. I'm really bad. I'm sorry. I have a catalog I somewhere. I could look one. it up. Yeah, there's right. a new raspberry smell that smells good too and it's similar to this. I feel like it's similar to this one. I ordered a bunch of spring scents for us. They should be coming soon. I'm excited to change my warmers out. I might put some of these. Raspberry bush. Good job. Thank you, Amanda. Thank you. This is delicious. Okay, so Country Plum. Any of my customers who want a sample, um... There's a link in the caption of this video, like when you see the link scrolling on your Facebook feed, there's a link. Fill it out and get a sample. Um, I'm doing my sample club a little differently this month. Um, I wanna send them just to people who want them. Novel idea, right? Um, so, how do you get your husband to help with videos? He's just cool, look how cute he is. He makes the video better, he's adorbs. And then I have a cute baby. She's helping us out too, but I'm making her do it. <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't know she's helping us right now. Hey, Eliza, how do you feel about Country Plum? There you have it. That's how she feels about Country Plum. We need Eliza at least once every minute. There you go again. She's going to sign off. She's going to say, all right, guys, fill out the form. If you want... Sorry, I'm trying to read comments. If you guys want some Country Plum, fill out the form. I bother her all the time. I'm sorry. All right, guys. Keep it Christine Steinbrook. Peace out.